Hi and welcome to another episode of... Am I recording? Yes. <laughs> welcome to another episode of Bleakburn. And today we are back at university uh, for Mindy's second year, I think. Yes, <laughs> of university. And here we have Anton and uh, Karita Persson. They have a quite interesting story. I mean, he was... <laughs> He was with uh, engaged to Tina actually, but he broke that off and he he started flirting with all sorts of people. He's a family sim, so it's really strange that he does that. But I mean, he's been flirting with Mindy sort of, and he's been flirting with other people here. Like Jackie yeah, had a go with him. <laughs> And then all of a sudden Elizabeth swooped in and like snatched him or whatever. And then they were at a party over in Bleakburn and Carita tried time and time again to kiss him. Like she went in for first kiss over and over and over again and he wouldn't have it. <laughs> <laughs> so um but she thinks he's moderately attractive i guess i don't know why why she was doing that it was like she was set on having some anton i guess he wants to be best friend with mindy i was trying to i was going to try and fix them up but now i'm I, i'm thinking that he might he he seems very set on elizabeth so they can have each other they're both to be townies so that's it's it's all fine he doesn't have any want to do some kind of student work so i'm just gonna go through them and see if someone does she wants to do research with someone and write a term paper elizabeth one and since she is her meter here is uh empty but she has the potential to uh, to get a good grade if she can just show the professors what she knows that's how i see this like when they get skill points this meter gets bigger uh, because they have the potential to they have the knowledge so they should get the highest grade you know if they fill this up but if they can't show that they know everything then it won't get filled up mindy you're in the way you want she wants to be best friend with anton too so well since they want to be best friends with each other see they have quite a good attraction so i thought i thought they would you know do the thing stop it you're in the way <laughs> Now you can go and have a go at the computer. Not everyone can afford a computer in their room, you know. Mindy could. So if she wants to do something on the computer later, then I'll buy her a computer. Man, they're loud. Something is happening in the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> I think someone set the stove on fire. Well, um, Tina also wants to write a term paper. She's on academic probation, actually. And she has a computer in her room, uh, but she is quite stinky. So she can try and, and uh, have a shower first and then try and do the term paper. No, she, I told you to go have a shower. Why won't you do it? Let's see if these two can become friends. Then maybe she will get a uh, want to do some study work. She wants Jacke to go to college, but he has no, absolutely no desire to do so. So he won't. But she got hungry. Luckily, the food is ready. Why am I not allowed? Oh, <laughs> she has. We need an extra bench over here. We have three. What? Am I not allowed to? What bench is that? I want to use the eyedropper a tool oh, so annoying what does it look like these ones yeah but with another top there you go now he will serve three dishes at once maybe the food will uh, be sufficient for the students yes if you don't like the garbage then take it out <laughs> i quite like this student housing it's quite nice elizabeth is actually on her third fourth year and she is like unsynced with everyone so I'm looking forward to uh, her moving out. <laughs> and she has claws. It bugs me that uh, the game doesn't sort them in the, the, the order I want them in. Because she, she is in the fourth year, I want her on top. But that's not how the game works, apparently. Well, since you just want to be friends with him, I guess, and try and work on that. She also wants to be friends with different professors here. So... We could call them up. Do a little gossip, see if you know something. 
She's gossiping about the dog. <laughs> what could you possibly know about the dog that would be gossip worthy? We don't know. Mindy currently has the hots for Glenn Perla, it says here. Which is, um, yeah, I mean, he is available. Sort of. But in the last episode, we decided that Krista wants to marry him. So that would be some kind of problematic if someone snatched him up. But Mindy is in college. She doesn't have time for those sorts of things, I guess. I think. She has a really good uh, relationship with Glenn. I can't remember when they met. But, you know, they've been neighbors. So that's probably why. Everyone keeps stealing him in this bed because it's a nice bed. There, uh, Elizabeth is back from class and she is writing her term paper now. Um, everyone is doing quite well in this college. It's almost boring. <laughs> but we'll see if there's some drama or something. What is Mindy doing? She's playing some games. She wants to be friends with Krista. Yeah, okay. And she wants to play chess. So I'm gonna have her practice some chess. She needs logic skill for her degree. So that is perfect. Who's this now? Manuel Seder. Okay. Uh, will you join me playing chess? Yes, you will. And Elizabeth is done with her with her term paper. So now she has um, pretty much secured her way out of college. She will graduate uh, successfully. She also wants to do an assignment and do research with someone. So maybe I will... Oh, I can lock both of these. <laughs> Didn't think about that. Minda has gained a point of logic skill. That's awesome. Now she has the potential to pass this term. She also needs creativity skill to be awesome. <laughs> but I'm gonna let her continue a playing chess because when they need a skill point in one category here, it's very likely that they're gonna need more of them later in the degree. So stop going in there you can go sleep in your own room thank you very much all right uh anton now has the want to get engaged to elizabeth so i think he uh, needs to have a shower <laughs> before he can do anything of the sort she's over here playing the piano so if he just has uh, fixes himself up a little bit then he can try and propose to her because they have such a good relationship already so i think he can just flat out propose well he could start with caressing her i guess they both look kind of <laughs> weird i kind of want them to have a baby just because they they have such distinct um appearances but you know we can't always have babies these are townie sims so they're destined not to have babies in my game unfortunately for them because they will ha not have a house so they will not have anywhere to keep it there they go he could of course make her pregnant while they're in college and then they could give the baby up to the orphanage <clears throat> if we really wanted a, a little baby from these two um, oh, well, if that happens, it happens. He wants now to gain a skill point and he needs nothing for his uh, major. So I don't know. I'll just lock that in and let him do his thing. Uh, she wants to probably continue this date. Charita sure has <laughs> is in a good mood. Uh, she wants to write no play a computer game i thought it was the term paper but it's not uh she could try and clean something to get a, a cleaning skill point but she wants to talk about her hobby so talk about hobby what is her hobby she has quite a lot of interests but her true hobby is games so talk about hobby games mindy still wants to be best friends with anton so i i think i'm gonna Try and pursue that. Oh, and she wants to go and pee. <laughs> oh, she also wanted to talk about hobbies. So that worked out well. 
But go and pee before you pee your pants. Well, it's in the middle of the night and everyone is still up because it's college. But I think I'm gonna put Mindy to sleep. Carita wants to write a term paper and do an assignment. She also wants to re do research with someone. Who else wanted to do that? Elizabeth. So you two can go. How do you do that? Is it college research? And then Carita, you could try and join that study session. They do have a TV, but not many students seem to want to watch TV. How do I join the study session? Join group research. Oh, she did not think that it was attractive to, <laughs> to be sitting there in a llama costume. Well, the hearts want what they want. I don't know. Anton decided to sleep in Mindy's bed again. Well, that is very interesting. <clears throat> Tina here uh, on academic probation. She wants to write a term paper and study and all that, but she uh, never has good motives. Well, her needs. Let Let's try and have her work on the needs area a little bit and see if we can't get her to actually write that term paper. She's very fussy. What, why is it so fussy with her? Uh, she is active. <laughs> She's very sloppy. She is a bit shy and playful. Okay. Now her needs here is in the green. So let's force her to try and write that term paper. Maybe she'll stay <laughs> at the computer for a long enough to get somewhere at least. I'm gonna unlock the do assignment for Elizabeth because she won't benefit from doing it. I think she can stop researching too because not benefiting from it. The university examinations office has scheduled Elizabeth's final exam to begin in five hours. Do not be late. So I, I think, I, I don't think she will have any children in her life unless she befriends one of my uh, residents. Let's uh, keep an eye on, on Elizabeth then. Okay, Tina gave up on that <laughs> term paper writing stuff and uh, is having some fun. Which is good because her fun meter is very low. So let's just leave her doing that. Someone else's fun meter is also very low. I usually wait with starting the term paper even if their needs are high until they have a full... Um, meter here that they can fill up uh, because that will benefit them the most i feel but in order to do that she needs to want to do some cleaning or studying some cleaning and she uh, she hasn't rolled that want mindy's bank deposit account has gained interest of 500 well aren't you wealthy uh she now has 9300 <laughs> anton is sitting on the toilet reading the newspaper if someone rolls the want to in influence someone else to clean then i usually check who needs the cleaning skill point oh he did it at all Honestly. All right, which we all know Kahita does. She needs a cleaning skill point, so there's plenty of stuff to clean if any students should want to. Oh, they have bills to pay as well. Uh, Kahita, you can go and pay the bills. It's two hours left until Elizabeth's exam. Minnie wants to talk about a hobby. Her true hobby is games as well. Tina and... wasn't that Tina's hobby too? Oh, so Carita's uh, true hobby is games and also Minda is that they should be getting along famously. Talk about hobby games. Elizabeth is due for her exam. Let's have her go. She never rolls the ones that I want her to roll. She wants to play with Tina. Okay, uh, tickle her then. But she wants to be... Oh, don't kiss him. Talk to him. Talk about hobby games to him and see what he, he thinks about her hobby. Because she wants to be good friends with Anton. And she also wants to appreciate Tina. What is going on here? I don't know. It's like human relationships. Only they're not human. They are simulated people. <laughs> Maybe I can have a snowball fight. The best time to go to college is obviously autumn because at autumn you learn skills easy, more easily. But Mindy went to college during winter, so uh, and during winter you have a bonus of all relationship building. So that's interesting too. How are you doing, Tina? Go have a little use of that and then continue your term paper. I want you to write it. Please do. She also s stinks. Maybe I should have her take a shower once, <laughs> as long as she got into the bathroom and then write the term paper. 
Well, they're gaining a relationship quite well. That's good. Even though they have their winter clothes on, they still get cold, I think. So I think if you just stay outside when it's winter, you can freeze to death, even though you have the right clothes on, I think. Not sure about that. But they're done with the snowball fight. How will I get her to get be friends with him? Okay, so wow, Elizabeth finished the semester with high enough grades to snag a spot on the coveted Dean's list. Great work. Elizabeth has graduated. Time to tie up loose ends and maybe throw a graduation party. Elizabeth finished the semester with a grade of A+. As a result, the school is giving Elizabeth a final grant of 1,200. And I think what we want to do is have a graduation party for her and we are going to note that she is going to take 1200 with her when she leaves i think we're gonna just put that in her bank account actually i'm not sure how it works because i'm gonna move her into some random lot and then make her a townie and i don't think townies has funds household funds because they're not households so land deposit 200 so what we do is put her money in her bank account and then move her out without any money and then I'll m just make her townie some somehow. She has 72 hours before she must leave campus. I don't think she must leave because I think I have mods for that. But I think she's going to. So now she has 1,200 in her bank account. And you don't pay when you graduate because you're not staying for another semester. So we could just have her uh, throw a party, graduation party, at once. And I'm going to move in some other student because according to my spreadsheet, I don't have a played sim uh, ready to uh, move in to college anytime soon. I don't know if she will get to keep her bank account while she is a townie, but I have uh, my spreadsheet here. <laughs> where it's noted that she should have that. So if she ever moves in with someone and doesn't have the money, then we'll just fix it. Here's all the people that came to the party. It's gonna be a great party, I think. <laughs> Mindy is just sitting here talking to Anton. She still wants to be best friends with him. I think they're gonna become best friends soon. Entertain, do a toast. <laughs> just because we can. Well, maybe if we hug him friendly, it must be possible to become best friends fast. Come on, hug, do another friendly hug. Oh, Tina just finished her term paper. I forgot, I put her over here, but that's fantastic. Look at all the progress she made. <laughs> now she's surely going to pass, but I, I'm gonna lock in to do an assignment, but I'm gonna wait and have her just do whatever she wants and hopefully she will be in a good mood when they do the exam. What is happening? Pillow fight. Yes. Let's have one. The party is a snoozer for some reason. I don't know why. Tina, Anton and Carita will probably be able to have a common graduation party if none of them get another probation. We'll see. Oh, he's Jacke. He, he has been like dating. Mindy a bit and she wants him to go to college but as I said he is a he's a popularity sim and he just thinks about parties and having fun and doing stuff like that so he has not been getting the one to get go to college and he has only one day left uh, until he grows up and I have decided that if you get the notice that you will uh, grow up in one day and you still haven't gotten the, the want to go to college, then you're not going to college. <laughs> I think. I mean, if he like rolls the wand like really late, then I might, but probably I'm just going to have a party for him and have him grow up without going to college. I want this wand to, to be fulfilled because it's a power wand, so uh, she will benefit from that. Oh, could do this. What's her lifetime wand? 
her lifetime want is to graduate three children from college then i'm not gonna give her the super fertility at this point because she doesn't need to have tons of children and if i can fulfill this then i might get something else there that might be related to college so like go and hug him again <laughs> i just want them to be become best friends now she has class in one hour so hug him fast oh that didn't do much did it what does he want? He wants to perform music for tips. So since since there is a party going on, he can try and do that. It's such, such a snoozer. Why is it? Maybe you should try and like entertain people. Do a dirty joke. <laughs> it's gonna be nice. Now she wants to talk to Anton, but he's... I thought he was busy playing, but he's not. So. Oh, Chanel, Chanel, you are not <laughs> very <laughs> smooth. Could you stop trying to steal people's boyfriends? I mean, come on. She tried to, she tried to kiss uh, her foster dad. I mean, that's strange. And now she tries to kiss Anton over here, and he's like, uh, no, thanks. And then she got admired by this professor. Like Chanel, I, she has never gotten any want to like marry or something like that, so I'm not sure. I, I was thinking like maybe she was asexual, but she tries to kiss people sometimes. <laughs> yeah, snoozer. Is she going to bed? Yeah, is she going to sleep? Yes. Nice party there. <laughs> <laughs> You're crazy partying. Um, yeah, trust me. If you go to sleep during one of your parties, people are not gonna have a good time. <laughs> well, someone is calling. Please answer. It drives me nuts. Congratulations on hosting a terrific party. Was it terrific? I thought it was a snoozer. <laughs> Your guest had a fantastic time. Final party score, not bad. Okay, well, yeah, there were people here, at least. I mean, that's what it, what it was. Hey, Anton, is Tina available to talk? Sure. I mean, she's asleep, but she could not sleep. Go and talk to the phone. Now they all have class in one hour <laughs> while Elizabeth is leaving campus. Oh, she's gonna grow up now. There she goes. Does all sims have teeth like that? I don't know. Well, where is she? She's over here. She looks really happy to have graduated. Oh, she didn't move out. Right, yes, because they are... Oh, she can move out now or stay, for example, to wait for peers to age up and leave to together later. So, move out now. Uh, I think we are going to move her. No, wait. I can just make her a townie from here. So if I click no, she's a grown up, yes. And then I can use some hacked object that I might have over here maybe. Make me a townie. Yeah. And we already settled her money and everything, so that's fine. And she's just gonna leave the lot that way. There we go. Now we have an extra room to spare, I think. Maybe I made a mistake by doing that. Oh, that's still Elizabeth's room. Oh, well, it's it's free now. So, I take my sim, <laughs> that is, not to be a townie, and I call college, and then we go to campus directory, and we sort on relationship, and we have Manuel Seder, which is fantastic, because... I think we invite him over because we have so many girls in here and only one guy and you know the bathroom situation <laughs> is that he can always use the bathroom whenever he wants but the girls have troubles because it's busy so we invite him over sounds great and now he's gonna be sort of I don't know when he's I think he's gonna be out of sync but I'm gonna say that when these guys have their fi final exam then the episode is over so i'm gonna fix that with my here he is can i just i think we just like move him in like this move in manuel seder there we go he is on his first year of course because no student ever does anything um so i'm gonna add him to my spreadsheet 
Monuel, and he is a popularity sim. Since he is on his first year, and the rule is you can go to college when you're 18, I'm gonna set him to 18. And of course, we don't know anything about his bank account or anything. Oh, but he has a lot of skills. How did this happen? But he's undeclared. Um, but I'm gonna get him a loan jar and make him take a loan. 500. Ah, where is it? Borrow 500 and then put it in your inventory. Also, he is a popularity sim. I'm just gonna do that for him. His lifetime wish is to become a celebrity chef, so maybe that was a mistake to do that, but it's done. <laughs> he wants to reach logic level 9. Mm, and creativity level 5. I'm gonna lock the creativity pack for him. And then he can, hey, give me that room. Ah, <laughs> uh, go away. Okay, well, I, I think he's gonna let go of that room. Ture, where, where did you come from? I didn't see you. <laughs> well, I think Ture is going to move out. We could have just waited on to, uh, to see who, who did this and then move them in, but I didn't do that now. <laughs> She wants to play chess again, so okay, go practice. And maybe we can uh, get him out of these clothes. Uh, change your parents. He, is he blonde? But he was that before, right? I didn't. I didn't change him to blonde. He was. I think he was. So <laughs> maybe we put him in that hairstyle <laughs> that Tura has, just to like be like, uh, no, this room is mine. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. Yeah, you know what? Let's let's do that. There and then we also want him to use a dresser and plan the everyday outfit. I don't want you to go around being a mascot. <laughs> well, maybe he could be, but I'm choosing not to. Well, these clothes are very smart. There's not many options. He's gonna look exactly like Anton if we do this. That doesn't seem right. Um. Oh well, he he will just have to do with this. People have weird clothes in college. <laughs> Maybe this is... We can shop online, actually. I'm gonna choose not to. <laughs> and have him work on his creativity level. I think it's Tina that did this. Uh, I'm gonna scrap the painting and have him paint instead. Because he has the want for it. And Tina has started the painting and walked away. He has 71 hour until final exam. I guess he's just taking a long year. <laughs> <laughs> um, because he, he got generated, yeah, th this is how it goes. So I'm going to, yeah, I'm just gonna let him have this year, like, the, it will last forever. I could probably change that in SIMPE, actually. Tina is now doing great and she will be moving up to her fourth year if everything continues this way. Minda is not doing fantastic, but he's, she's doing okay. Anton is asleep. <laughs> So I'm, I'm just gonna let her keep playing there. Charita now wants to gain a creativity level skill. We could invest in another easel. No, we could have her practice on piano. Because if she fulfills this, she might get another want to do similar stuff. Go away, Bengt. Well, yes, attractive apparently. But could you stop? <laughs> Who is this Bengt person? Bengt Polgren. And Carita thinks he is <laughs> very attractive. Okay. Well, talk to him then. She has two bolts with him, but apparently he, he doesn't appreciate her like she <laughs> appreciates him. Well, appreciate him then. Stop, stop. He doesn't want to talk about work things. Now she can practice. Well, I, I, I guess Manuel will have to sleep on a bench if this keeps up but or the sofa but th that's probably fine there's bills again they can't uh, afford it so i'm gonna give them money for it this is how i do he want to sell a great novel all right okay uh, i guess then you want to write a novel first write novel you should also finish this painting and sell it because it's awful okay <laughs> i i randomized this so he's writing a novel, novel about aliens that turns into elephants and have soup uh, with bugs in them, and then it starts to rain. I guess. <laughs> I can't. I, I realized I want him to finish the painting first. Anton is not doing very well. He wants to gain a skill point, but he really needs to study if he wants to get a good grade. 
but what I'm gonna do is have him have nice fill up his needs and hopefully that will allow him to do great on the exam. Carita still doesn't want to learn about cleaning because I guess she doesn't like cleaning. But she can stop practicing now. Now it's five hours left until everyone's uh, examinations. I'm just gonna let them do what they do and hope that they do well. I'm very excited I tried this cuisine activity. That was a lot of fun, says Manuel. All right, so we can note that he likes cuisine. Like in case that's ever relevant <laughs> to anyone. Now Tina wants to influence someone to clean. And who needed that? I think it was Carita, right? Yes, Carita needs a cleaning skill so Tina is going to go over here and influence to clean and I hope there's some dirty stuff oh I gave them enough money to pay the bills but I didn't actually do the thing oh no she went into a room we can't do it now all right well we can knock on the door of course could force her to come out come on get out here I want you to clean come on oh did that just let me in okay can I wake her up? Influence to clean. You don't clean anything. Go and clean something. Uh, I don't know if that's going to be enough for her to actually gain a skill point, but it might. She has only two hours until her final exam, so we'll see what happens. Yeah, there's one hour left. Everyone is going, I hope. Yes. Minda is very... <laughs> set on uh, making the bed first. I'm gonna, uh, she might be late to the exam, but she's not on academic probation. The worst that can happen is that she gains the skill point. Oh, she's far off. Well, I don't know. <laughs> you better go, actually. Go to final exam, stop cleaning. There you go. Okay, Mindy has gained enough life experience to change aspirations. Would you like to change Mindy's aspiration? Uh, yes, always. Uh, let's see. Mindy has randomized the family aspiration, but her true aspiration is actually pleasure, which might not be that great. Uh, she likes unemployed people, but I'm gonna re-roll these. <laughs> she likes gray hair. All right, that's interesting. And witchiness. Okay, and her turn off is... She doesn't like logical people. Well, <laughs> that's interesting, isn't it? Okay, so uh, let's see what everyone did. Carita's met all the requirements to become a senior. She made it. Carita finished the semester with a grade of C. As a result, the school has given Carita a grant of 400. That means she will have to pay 100 and she does not have a bank account so she will take out a loan of 100 that's not much but it's it is what it is there so then we're done with her kelly just gained enough life experience to be able to lock up up to two ones in the ones and fear panel great she still wants to write a term paper oh now she doesn't need cleaning anymore so that's good she uh, she can just get on working on that in the next episode Mindy has met all the requirements to become a junior. Mindy finished the semester with a grade of B minus. As a result, the school has given Mindy a grant of 600. That's not great, but she gets to put 100 into her uh, bank account. Bank online, deposit, 100. And now she, <laughs> now she has won a party and stuff. So like, there's a big chance that she's gonna flunk out of college, but we'll see. She needs a lot of creativity skill and some cooking. And Anton has met all the requirements to become a senior. Anton finished the semester with a grade of C-. As a result, the school is giving Anton a grant of 300, which means he needs 200 more for the household funds. So let's borrow. And now he has a loan of 900. Tina has met all the requirements to become a senior. Tina finished the semester with a grade of A minus. Where's Tina? There's Tina. Um, as a result, the school has given Tina a grant of a thousand. So she could, so 500 of those are to be uh, paid to the school, but she could repay this loan. I think that's the easiest. She she owes 500, so pay back 500. So now she has uh, no loan. You just keep that loan jar. So now she is even. And that's everybody. So let's 
just have Mindy here go and fix the computer stuff. Whoops, <laughs> someone just came streaking in. Uh, hi, Carola. Wouldn't that be really awkward standing full front naked in front of someone? <laughs> Yeah, that's what happens in college, I guess. Never happened to me, fortunately. 100 uh, successfully added to Mindy's bank deposit account. She now has 9,400 in there. And that concludes this episode. Nobody, nobody is on probation anymore. Tina made it to her senior year. Oh, she's really cute. Anton got engaged to Elizabeth and Elizabeth graduated. And we had Manuel Seder moving in instead. He's over here sleeping in Mindy's bed. Uh, Carita didn't do much, but she passed her third year and she is now a senior and Mindy is is now a junior. She only has two more years of college and she switched aspiration to pleasure <coughs> and I'm uh, I'm not sure she's going to make it. We'll see next time I play this university lot what will happen if she ends up on academic probation or if she actually makes it or uh, what happens. The ages for everyone is Elizabeth is now 22 and she moved out. Uh, Tina is also 22. Anton is 21. Carita is 21 and Mindy is 21. And Manuel Seder is 19. And I hope you will have a fantastic time until next time I see you and take care. Have a super duper time, don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and everything and goodbye!